Hello and welcome to the latest issue of Extracted and welcome to the new year and the new decade. It's been a really interesting time uh, for me actually. I've been uh, looking back at, well, the past decade and a lot of that time has been spent uh, building and working on the magazine. Uh, going all the way back to uh, December 12th, uh, 2012 is when, it was either the 9th or the 12th, when I published the very first issue of the magazine, and it was called Coffee Lovers Magazine back then. And I started looking at the old issues and found uh, in the first holiday special that I did, uh, I talked about how I make coffee, like kind of where I am in coffee and where I want to go is kind of what uh, that was about. And it's very interesting for me to look at that and see how much has changed for me in the way that I consume and look at coffee and how much I followed, really kind of followed the path that I said I was going to follow. Um, I, in that article, I talked about how I brewed coffee and how I wanted to brew it and where I thought I would go with it. And a lot of that has certainly come to pass. Uh, I've added things that um, I didn't think I would, such as uh, making espresso and that sort of thing. And also looking back on the issues you may, not, you may not realize this, you may not know this uh, as you're watching this, but um, the magazine is largely just me working on it. For most of the time, I had uh, a lot of help with the, um, the graphic design. So my good friend, um, Michael Mage, has been a, a massive help with the design and layout of the magazine. Uh, if you look at the first year of the magazine, it was entirely me, 100%. I did all the design and everything, and I did it in Keynote, uh, which, is, which is really kind of funny. The, the, original, um, the original feel to it was very different from the way it is now. Uh, and Michael came in and gave it a much more professional look, uh, which was really fantastic. And now uh, it's entirely me working on it again. Uh, Michael's moved on to uh, greater things uh, and, and uh, you know, left a great legacy here. And I thought uh, for beginning the new decade, having seen, like look back on myself and seen how far I've come, why not share that? Uh, talk about all the changes that have happened and reflect and think about the future as well. So uh, that's kind of what this issue, uh, a lot of what this issue is about for me. And I hope that it's interesting to you as well and maybe you can think about how far you've come in the past uh, decade uh, in terms of coffee, in terms of yourself and your life and all those sorts of things. Uh, really appreciate you following along and reading the magazine. If you haven't signed up to the email newsletter, uh, I do have a lot to share through email. You can get the whole series on becoming a coffee connoisseur, and then whenever I find something interesting that I like to share uh, just about coffee in general or coffee-related things, I share that there. Uh, you can sign up to the email newsletter below the video. Uh, go ahead and check it out. Thank you again. I hope you enjoy this issue, and I'll see you in the next one.